Hello everybody. So today I want to talk about calculus. The topic today is about differential equations. So now I want to show you how to answer. So we need to divide both sides by dx. So we have x square y square s y they are the read number two so this is about homogeneous so i will put about y equals to v s later that we do first the derivative for the both side so we have the y over the s next we do first the derivative of v so we have dv over dx multiplied by s. This one we have number one. So we have v. And that is about the product roof of the refer to. Next, y we change by vs. dy over dx we change by this one. This one we change by Vs. Next, we simplify S square for the both sides. Next, we divide both sides by 3 minus V square. So, the next one, we need to open parentheses. So, this one I will put on the right. Now, we do common denominator. So, negative v with number 3, we have negative 3v. Negative, negative, we have positive 2v to the power of 3. Next, this one, we have negative v. Now, we put this one go to the left the S and S go to the right. Next, I will put the integration for the both sides. Now I will concentrate on this one. So we can do about factorization by V. Now we can use about partial fractions. Because we have the power 2 on V, that means on numerator, we need to reduce the power by negative number 1. So 2 minus number 1, we have positive V in here. Next, we do common denominator. So this one. It is missing about negative number 1 plus 2v square. So capital A multiplied by negative number 1 plus 2v square. About this one, it is missing about v. Next. 
next we need to arrange based on the terms of v about v square we have to with a b with v in here so we have b about v we have only c about the number we have negative a now we need to compare coefficients we have negative number two that means two a plus b equals to negative number two we don't have v so c equals to number zero and a that is about number three in here So A equals to negative number 3, B equals to number 4, C equals to number 0, and now we put A, B, C cone here. So A equals to negative number 3 b equals to positive number 4 and c equals to number 0 and now we have the final answer the integration of this one we have negative number 3 ln of the absolute value of v this one we have ln of the absolute value of negative number 1 plus 2v square and I will put about c now we go back in here so the integration of this one that is about this one this one we have ln of the absolute value of s now about v that is about this one so we divide both side by s and now we need to change v into this one now we have the condition So before we can use about this one, we need to arrange a little bit. So we have ln a minus ln b equals to ln of a over b. So we can apply the formula in here. So this one we have ln of the absolute value of y minus f and of the absolute value of s so this one i will put in here so negative number three with negative we have positive number three minus l and of the absolute value of s so this one we have like this next I will put E for the both side so before we use about E I need to put negative number 3 positive number 2 go inside about natural law in here because we have the formula So I will need to put E for the both sides. So
So for this one, we can put like this. So we can simplify this one. We know that e to the power of c that still consider about the constant. This one we have number one. So this one we have y square over s square. Now we can do common denominator. So this one combined with this one. So S where S where we can so oh, I'm missing about negative in here. Next we have the condition. That means when s equals to number 0, y equals to negative number 1. So I will put number 0 going here, negative number 1 going here. So we simplify and we have number 2. So c equal to 1 over 2. So I will put 1 over 2 going here. And now I will put number 2 go to the right. This is the end. Thank you for watching.